All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you back to another episode of Hunter Call of the Wild. The main issue for today, we are going to be finishing up our Predator's mission. We have harvested our three grizzly bears, and we have gotten our grizzly with a gold standard. And we now must finish up our mission. We must hunt down two more wolves to complete the five wolf total. So that is what we are here to do today. And this is the mission right here. Five gray wolves, and we must have the three grizzlies, and we already have that if you've watched our previous video. If not, go watch it. The bears rushed out from the forest and almost ran me the fuck over. Anyway, with all that being said, let's look for these wolves, shall we? We're up here in the recovering Tikon forest, where you would typically find some gray wolves. In packs ranging from two up to six, I've seen. But that's only my experience. I'm sure maybe the wolf packs are a lot larger. But they are very interesting animals in the map. And I think they do something good for the region because they give an active predator and they're coming to get you if you're not careful. Let's just peek over the ridge because that call you just saw a second ago, she should be close by. And there she is. Oh, I was right. I was just taking a guess saying it was a girl. Oh, one of them just ran off, but I'm only focusing on these two right here. They're running away. Maybe I was a little bit too loud. But, um, let's see. Can I get a shot? No. Oh, I missed it. I probably thought about I shouldn't have pulled that trigger. But I did because I'm stupid. But oh, she's probably not. Well, she's not going too fast, so maybe we can just keep on her trail and we'll be able to get her down. Let's get the binos out real quick. How far away is this pretty little lady? She is about the 200 meter mark. They get far pretty quick. Well, I guess they're designed to run down, so they can run for very long periods of time. Um, Let's see. Well, they're just pacing. Shouldn't have whistled. I hit the wrong button. Well, they they say they're fleeing, but they're just circling around that certain spot. Either they're waiting for more pack members, or they're maybe just going to start to come back. Um, that one's starting to go up over the hill, so she's going to be my target right here. This level 2, I'm just going to move a little bit to the left so I can avoid um, a shot between less trees. Um, okay, we just got to go nice and slow with this one. But Oh, the... The color and the design of the scope, like a bit of a dark field around it, plus with the color of the wolf, I couldn't see where my bar was. So I didn't know where I was going to be. There we go. Okay, 50, 75, 25, 50, 0, 25, and down. And there she is. And a single long... But we still got it. 99% on the quick kills. And so is a bronze. Alright, just following some caribou tracks. They were not too far, actually, from where I found the wolf. So, let's go see what we can find. And there he is. Quick level 3. Probably going to be a silver. Why did I take off my scope? A little closer, get him up. Ooh, perfect broadside view. And you can just hear those wolves going crazy. Broadside again. Clean kill, double lung, definitely. All right, now we just gotta chase him down. Oh, we did a U-turn and he's gonna fall right between those trees. That is absolutely, absolutely perfect. And I'm not going to do a camera because he's actually not that far away. So, um, speaking of the wolves, I've actually been recently watching um, the movie called Alpha. If you haven't watched it, it's about this caveman boy and this injured wolf who tried to kill him at one point. And they're trying to survive with their symbiotic sort of friendship. No spoilers, though. I won't tell you how the movie ends or anything that significantly happens within the story of the movie. Just go and give it a watch if you're into the caveman era and the bond with early men and wolves. It's a good movie. I highly recommend it. 
I, sometimes I see wolf packs on these banks. Um, let's see. Oh, there's, oh, there's one. Oh, it's another caribou. And he's coming this way. Oh, he's a little nervous, though, so I'm going to have to be careful. Oh, the wind's blowing at him, too. That ain't good. As long as he gets close enough and I'm fast enough to take a shot, it shouldn't be too hard. All right, he's going to sneak up over this ridge. And as soon as he takes a few more steps closer, we're going to be able to take a shot. So with all that being said, of course, we're just going to wait a little bit. 157, 56, 55, 54, 52. Just got to wait for him to take a quick pit stop and then we'll crack him right in the chest. Alright, pop up from behind that tree. I'm sorry, I got my range all wrong. That wasn't a 50, that was an 8. I don't know what I was saying. I'm a bigger idiot than you guys thought I was. That right, 164. Boom! Right in the chest. All right. Now it's time to chase him down. Silver. Not too special. Decent size rack, I think. Good curve on it. Oh, only a single? That's some bullshit, ain't it? Alright, we're just heading for this railway bridge because I want to finish up this wolf mission before we sign off here. Ooh, can I just go over the edge? Nope, nope. Use the roll. What the literal fuck was that? I just did a barrel roll off the side of the tunnel. Now, this particular spot on this lake, I've seen other packs cross. I've seen caribou herds here, and quite a few wolf packs have crossed this way. I forgot what time the train comes. It comes around 1 o'clock, right? At least I think. So I'm just going to go over this way, see if I can spot anything. So, well, I hear it panting. So they're probably close, so I just can't... Oh, there was... There's one. Oh, there's a female. Is that level three? Oh, what's this guy? Ooh. I believe I've just found my target. Gotta wait for him to take a break, though. I'm gonna dial it up to 164. A little bit more sideways, if you please. Good boy. This will be quick. Hopefully, a bit less painful. Right into the bushes. There I am. Yeah, there he is. Right, he's down. Poor guy. He just had to lay down and admit defeat. He might be the leader of the pack, but out here, I'm the apex predator. There he is. Just got the scope off and ranging close in case they come back. That's a gold. Not bad. 100, 100, 100. Score rate 60. Hey there, Chichico. I just heard from Oscar. I'm sorry to say that he's going to be leaving us at the end of the season. Oh. He's been offered an opportunity to join a prestigious research team that's working in South Africa. Ooh. Which sounds like the perfect job for him. He told me that it was a really tough decision for him. He's been here since he graduated, and I know he's fallen in love with the reserve. I am happy for him, though. He deserves the chance he's been given. Yeah, good for him. Oscar also mentioned that he felt more comfortable leaving the reserve, knowing that I've got people like you on the team taking care of the place. Oh, man. Actually, his exact wording was, taking care of you, old man. <laughs> but that's just Oscar being Oscar. Well, that was a nice little dialogue. South Africa, isn't that where the um, Savannah is? On the Savannah map? Anyway, that completes our mission. We've got our three grizzlies and we have our five wolves. That is wonderful news. And I think this little wolf we collected deserves to 
belong in my trophy lodge. So, I'm going to do another quick camera cut here. I'm going to put them in the lodge. I'll be back with you guys in a second. Okay, we're back here in the lodge, and as you can see from the live stream, if you watched, we replaced the brown bears with grizzlies, and the moose in the middle now has a much larger rack. That's because I hunted another big one. So, anyway, with that being said, you're not going to be lonely anymore, buddy. I got your brother. Oh, put him down. There we go. Yeah, a little howling partner. Get him in the right pose. There it is. That's cool. I like that. Probably should have gotten him the female one, though. Could have had his own little bitch. But anyway, I believe that's going to do it for this video. If you liked it, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more content like this. And with that being said, this has been Eagle Owl Hunter, and I'll see you in the next one.